embarking in a new custom experience with this luxury home in a citrus screen over 2,000 square feet of unique upgrades, no associations, and the best part, really close in proximity to Lake Rosu. This is Margie Caldera, and welcome to a new tour. Hello, hello everyone. Welcome to a new tour. My name is Margie Caldera and if this is your first time in this channel, my mission is to show you guys all of the new construction projects in Senis, communities, resale properties, because why not? And obviously education about the real estate. So if this channel sounds like you, make sure to like, subscribe and comment for more content like this every week. On today's video, I'm in a Citrus Spring. This is Citrus County. And actually we are northwest of Central Florida. We are just one hour from Tampa, one hour, 30 minutes from Orlando. And I will tell you guys, this is gonna be the next boom town in the area. You just have to listen to me because that's what happened two years ago when I started making contact in Marion Oaks. About this particular location, we have infinite options, abundance of restaurants, of course a supermarket we have Publix we have two different wind dixies in the area we have different options for auto parts for guest station we have CVS we have Walgreens okay we have saved a lot of store just 20 minutes from this distance and also we have the HCA Florida Inverness Hospital just 18 minutes from this particular location about this gym property is a four bedroom two and a half bedrooms a two car garage 2,176 square feet. We're sitting in a 0.31 acre lot in this section, guys. And I will tell you, the front of the property, which is this driveway, is a magnet, okay? We have here space for two car garage inside. We have also double right here, which is four in total, plus those are more in this section. So easily you can park here six cars in this driveway now let's jump inside to enjoy this spectacular house all right all right my dear family as soon as we step in into this property the first thing that will cut my attention okay immediately is the foyer okay the foyer is this section right here perfect for your entry table in this section of course I have an amazing view right here with an open concept and then immediately to my right side, okay? I'm gonna step in into this impressive dining room, okay? Right here, we are talking about 16 feet high ceiling all the way to the top, makes the property in this particular location even bigger. We have right here an abundance of natural light, obviously because we have these large and extended windows in this section, of course, comes up with the screen protection but for me this is an amazing area for your first come meals for your celebration for your gatherings perfect for this combination you can fix right here pretty easy a square or a round table six to eight people in this particular area and then if we can move in into my say direction right okay let's go into the same flow okay i'm gonna step in there into a little hallway that will lead me to one completely side of the property that contains one half bathroom really convenient and important nowadays because we have the people coming into our places for celebrations and it's always a really functional have half a bathroom right here you can appreciate the finishes that for me are on top of the line we have obviously the toilet we have really nice and modern handles right here we have our uh, vanity section right here with granny countertops all of the houses still keeping the same style i really enjoy the smart mirrors right here okay you have a different options to connect with your bluetooth amazing feature and also we have extra cabinet space right here in case that you need more area to storage and then continuing with this same section, remember I told you about the other spot really important for us, which is the laundry section. Right here, 
we have the hooks for the wash and dry machine and another great feature i will tell you is having the sink okay for me i told you guys before in different videos it's really important to have this type of sink if when i do or manual like a uh, craftsmanship or even we have to you know wash our shoes it's really nice to have this special faucet right here okay it's nice it's the modest one and it's big actually the sink is really really big and also have an extra cabinet right here then just to my right side i have the door that will connect me with the double car garage another good fact about this section and it comes with the epoxy flooring which means you have a better finishes than the other properties and it has to be like that so we're talking about a luxury property okay with modern finishes it can be different in this section we have uh, the garage opener right here i love and enjoy the fact that you have a double window as well to enjoy natural light in this section and we have an extra area right here that we can use a part of our storage as well right here we have the ac unit we have the water here as well and also we have the electrical panel right there without mention that we have the easy access to outside of the property for this area okay now heading out of this area okay laundry uh garage then continue walking to my right side guys i have the first bedroom of today's video remember there's four bedrooms in total this is gonna be my first guest bedroom so if you follow me okay you will feel a really big and nice space into this guest bedroom so the majority of the properties like that has you know a regular guest bedroom this one is a nice because you can fit here a queen side bed with the side tables and lastly you have accordion doors in this area which is my closet now if you follow me go stepping into the yak and jill bathroom okay this is one of the nicest features that i see in properties because it's not just wonderful have the connection it's also you have a nice finishes and really functional area okay right here we're talking about a big vanity okay even though this is gonna connect two guest bedrooms we have right here the same finishes granny countertop we have even more cabinets obviously with the soft touch you can appreciate i really enjoyed that saying uh granny countertops we also have the special and smart mirror right here saying the faucets the only different if you follow me okay into the other section is we have the bathtub here okay remember the other was half a bathroom right here we have the completely full bath and it comes with bathtub guys it's important to keep in mind that this property has approximately 12 feet high ceiling in the entire property which means even in this bathroom we feel the high ceiling uh sense okay and then we have all of the ceramic tile in the entire section obviously we have this portion of natural light because we have an special window right there okay now heading the other exit of this uh, full pattern i have the entrance of the second guest bedroom of today's video guys i will tell you this is a little smaller than the other one but still and good decent space we're talking about high ceilings we're talking about decent space and the closet and i really enjoy these unwraps and shelf more than the other one okay these are stronger actually and as even more functional we have the nice and modern ceiling fans a uh, small window as well and we have another good plus which is the access okay the easy access to the cover land nine we have also the remote control in case that we want to do something right here okay because we have the connection the direct connection with it so that's why you have the control right here we want to go over the cover line in a little bit but let's continue with the rest of the house okay now just to keep going into the same flow remember we're heading from this side we describe all of the section now i'm stepping out of my second bedroom okay and then i have the easy access to this beautiful kitchen 
Okay, I cannot tell you guys how beautiful and functional because it's also important have this type of a kitchen. Right here, we have an abundance, even more natural light. Also, we're talking about bolted ceiling, okay? We have bolted ceiling in the entire property, beautiful finishes and designs, okay? Right here, we are in front of my island, so we have a beautiful and ample island, just a perfect for all of those uh, breakfast no go for breakfast bar you have also the option in this section right here to my right side this uh island is in granite contour top we have a double under mousing with the modern faucet just behind me we have the styling steel appliances we have the stove we have the microwave we have the dishwasher to the left i have the full side fridge um, also in terms of the space we have infinity options cabinets all the way down we have a 42 inch cabinets in the entire section you can see how tall it is we have also the chrome moldy and the hardwoods in the entire kitchen making even a perfect combination i will tell you another good fact is we have the ceramic backsplash just behind me in this section ascending and level up this area even more um, just in front of me we have all of the section for all the trash, okay? Really convenience as well. And I'm telling you, it's not just about how beautiful is the section, it's also how convenient it is. In the front of the uh, this island, so we have this space to park even two or three people right here, but I just wanted to show you that we have also extra storage in this section. It's a different color, but it's matching perfect with the other side as well. Just behind me, I have another area for your breakfast bar in case that you want to have your coffee machine, your air fryer, your toast, and in this section with a GFCE outlet right here, protecting the entire section, guys. We can even talk about the beautiful lighting right here, the pendant lighting in this section, my lamp right here. Okay, beautiful, beautiful options to upgrade the property even more. Then last section of this kitchen is my walk-in pantry, okay? This walk-in pantry has the same finishes in terms of the shelves. You can do something different, okay? I don't wanna lose you, but I just wanted to show you that I have more space here. Uh, we can do something uh, similar. We can do something even bigger and trying to improve the area. But what I like and enjoy about this is we have private lights and accordion doors. And last but not least, we have also the section for my breakfast nook right here, okay? It's not super big and ample, but still you can do a round table here, just a big four people. It's not gonna be the formal dining, okay? But it's still a good space to enjoy a fresco meal, especially because you have a nice interest of natural light also you have the access to the cover line eye as well from this location continuing now with my living area right here we're talking about like tray ceilings really really important and also multiple couch lightings and the entire section still you can appreciate how bright are the colors in this section just to tell you family we have right here um, luxury binder full plan in the entire house. We don't have carpet, okay? We don't have to worry about any nightmare of cleaning. This is water and scratch resistant, so you don't have to worry about anything. Also, we have this section for my entertainment area. Okay, we have the outlets right here. We have the connection for my cable. Um, I will tell you, you can do a TV here or not. It's totally up to you, but I really like and enjoy this setup just making a little different than the rest, okay, really important. And then just in front of me, I have the control for the ceiling fans, a really modern ceiling fan, so you can see the multiple options that you have right here, okay? You can go in like high levels or low levels. We can change the intensity of the light. If you wanna do another type of lighting, you can see right here, Okay, just if you want something kind of yellow and warm colors, you have the opportunity to do that. So there's different options and I think those little details comes in every property. So this is gonna be pretty much this section of the living. And just to finish the area, I just wanted to point out we have a double doors in this area with a nice 
and motor glass accents, okay? So really important, we don't have the regular sliding doors. Um, we have the accents right here that we will describe a little bit, but if you follow me, okay, we can continue with the rest of the house, which is in the opposite side of where we come from, okay? Now to the right side, I have the third guest bedroom, okay? Good, good, and nice distribution, guys. I really enjoy it. I think this is really cute that you have the uh, the tray ceiling in this room. Really cute, classy. Uh, we have the large and tall windows in this section. Similar finish to the rest one. The only difference, if you come to this section, uh, just in front of me, I have uh, the closet, which is a little shorter than the other one. Now, lastly, we're stepping into my completely private area. One of the corners of this property is my private section for my principal bedroom. And yes, have a completely door that will separate the rest of the property from the main room, okay? So in this entrance, we have a hallway that will lead me to the double walk-in closet. And then just at the end behind of me is at the bedroom. Now let's get into this first uh, to my right side, this walk-in closet, it's perfect in case that you have your partners and you just wanna to separate your own closet, it's really convenient, but if you don't, okay, you just use the one for your clothes and the other one for your shoes. Right here, we're talking about the same finishes in terms of the shelves, we have privatized private doors, and then just uh, crossing the hallway, we have then exactly same finishes. I really enjoy the fact that we're talking about high ceiling, so you can improve and do something different if you wanna do that, okay? You have totally the freedom of doing this. Okay, now coming back, if you follow me, okay, to the DN, so we have the entrance of the um, suite bathroom right here. We have obviously the extended vanity. In this occasion, we have just one sink in this particular section, but we have the same cabinets and finishes. I enjoy the fact that we have the same um, smart mirror right here. Really nice and really gorgeous with those finishes and touch on top of the line. We have obviously the private toilet and right here we have my section for the private shower. It doesn't come with the glass shower door. Well, that's for me that has to be here, a glass shower door to pop out this section even more. Okay, same finishes for the ceramic tiles all the way to the top. Okay, we have a double windows, perfect setup for those type of light shower. And then we have the holders right here. Another functional fact about this section. Okay, now if you follow me just straight, okay, walking straight, I will step in now into the main suite. Okay, now coming through this hallway that will separate this completely main bedroom from the rest of the house. Now I'm here in the uh, principal bedroom. Right here, guys, you have the really, really easy options to fit a king side bed, okay? With the side tables, side by side. That's just gonna be pretty much your section for it. Then you have the double windows, more natural light with the double door, with the tray ceiling, beautiful tray ceiling. And we're talking about a nice and modern ceiling fence, okay? And the top, without mention that you have many, many outlets right here in case that you wanna connect something. Uh, we have the entertainment cable center right here in this section. That's what I just stayed myself to the other side to show you a kind of perspective for your bed, okay? And then lastly, we have Finally, the exit to show you the cover the night. Okay, my beautiful family, we're almost done with this tour. We have this cover lanai in case that you wanted to do your uh, barbecues right here. The whole area, okay, is completely concrete slab. Okay, it's completely paint, so you don't have like rough finishes right here and then you have the same lighting without mention that we have the ceiling fan actually i'm gonna take the control from here remember so we have still the same option for all of the ceiling fan in the house um, i really enjoy this even more but if you keep walking so you have this whole setup for the entire section up to the end 
of one of the guest bedrooms if you remember at the beginning of the video so we have one exit from the main room another exit from the living area from the breakfast nook right there and lastly we have this one just in the corner from the second guest bedroom okay which is closed right now but i just wanted to tell you guys so you have an extended area so you can even screen in this and do something really nice on top of that then if you continue okay you have another piece of area which is a perfect in case that you want to do any private pool any nice uh, backyard i don't know you can do a garden you can do a better fruit trees in this section because let me tell you something this property comes with a public water so some of you guys don't like having like well water which is for me it's kind of the same uh the fact that you don't have to pay for uh public water is another plus but this property comes with public water okay of course a septic tank uh we have a 0 0.31 acre lot and we have shingles and the top we have all of the cvs construction in the entire property now my dear family i can't wait to show you how much money do you need to purchase this property in citrus spring and what are the best options for you so let's go family my dear family we finished with another successful showcase here in citrus spring remember this is a great option in case that you wanted to get a property really close up front of the big lake remember we have the lake rose right here just five minutes from this distance and you have an option for boating for fishing for kayaking great great outdoor activities without mention the citrus spring country club and in this location for those fans of a golfing i consider myself getting into the new sport but there's a lot of options for this property with also all of the great finishes four bedrooms two and a half bedrooms okay over 2,000 square feet sitting in 0 0.31 acre lot this property is everything that you has been dreaming about a new home in florida and the asking price of course is a little higher than the normal ones because look at this this is something completely unique and for that reason the price is 449,000 for this gorgeous property 2024. now remember no associations and no cdd so you have all of the freedom for whatever you want to do in this property outside and just uh, play with your imagination right here now my dear family let's jump into your numbers okay okay for all of my buyers out there if you're planning to purchase this property as your primary home okay remember that you can qualify with an fha which is the most are common for primary uh, residents or first-time buyers with 3.5 percent down payment okay in this scenario you will need a fifteen thousand seven hundred and fifteen dollars to purchase this property with 3.5 percent down payment which is the minimum okay and then your scenario will be something like this now principal and interest will be two thousand five hundred and ninety seven dollars and the reason why is because obviously we're talking about almost like 450,000 uh, property, okay? Then property taxes is gonna be $333, but guess what? If you do the home setup session, you will save hundreds in your tax bill. So super important, apply for homestead to drop the mortgage money payment. Then homeowners insurance, I did just a thousand because this property is uh, just immaculate from 2024, $0 in HOA, of course, in $120 for PMI. We're talking about 6% interest rate, which is the normal rate right now in the market. 
and then your mortgage money payment for this property with the minimum down payment is $3,134. Options, there are many options to drop your mortgage money payment. I told you already the homestead obsession if you want to be living on the property as your primary resident or even buy discount points or buy down the rate and in that way you can buy up to even 4% and there your mortgage money payment could be easily three four hundred less okay now for my dear buyers that can qualify so they couldn't qualify for an fha because fha has some regulations or whatever other program okay so you can purchase this property with a five percent down payment okay and in this case with a five percent down payment you will need twenty two thousand four hundred and fifty okay and then your mortgage money payment will look something like this $2,696 for your principal and interest, the same and the property taxes of $4,000 a year, $333 per month, $83 in homeowners insurance, and $150 for PMI, of course, no HOA. Um, your interest rate will be a little different in this type of like programs. Conventional loan is going to be approximately 6.2%, but still uh, you will have a mortgage money payment in $3,262 per month with a conventional loan 5% down payment. Okay, in case that you wanted to purchase this property as your vacation home, you have the chance to do that with a 10% down payment. It's going to be just uh, 49000 or for all of my investors out there either planning to purchase this property to do Airbnb, any short-term rental option or long-term rental, you have both options. So you will need approximately 89,000 or 90,000 to purchase this property with 20% down payment. Now the good fact is if you purchase a 20% down payment, you will avoid completely the PMI extra charge, okay? And then your scenario will be something like this. 2,389 for principal and interns. Uh, property taxes exactly the same, 333. $83 in homeowners insurance, $0 in HOA, $0 in PMI. We're talking about 7% interest rate. Remember, uh, when you buy a property as your second home or even invest in property, so your interest rate will be a little higher. And then your mortgage money payment will be $2,806 per month in this property okay lastly my dear family for all of my veterans usda programs you have the opportunity to purchase this property with a zero percent down payment no pmi both of you guys qualify to purchase actually this property so there's many advantages of qualifying with those programs okay now your scenario will look something like this two thousand $691 for principal and interest, $333 property taxes, $83 in homeowners insurance, no HOA, zero in PMI with same 6% interest rate. So your mortgage money payment will be $3,108 per month, okay? Either USDA or VA loans. My dear family, if you're looking at this type of property or another type of property, don't worry about it. I have infinite options, abundant options, endless options for properties here in Florida, okay? Remember, I'm the expert in the negotiations. I'm the expert in make sure you close that property. I'm an expert in make sure you get the best program depending on your particular conditions, okay? Properties, there's so many properties out there. Agents that opens the door for you, there's many people out there. You need someone to stay by your side, educate you the entire process, and make sure you close the property with the best protection, the best conditions, and the best deal on the market. So thank you so much for seeing another video. You know all of the options to contact me, okay? So just go to my link tree and connect with me in a phone, in a Zoom meeting, or even by email, different options out there. And for all of my investors or clients in South of Florida that want to invest or relocate here in Central Florida, my team and I are ready to support you all the time. I'll see you in the next video, my dear family. Take care and stay safe. Bye-bye.